The Millen Spaceport Development Board was disbanded in 2019 because state funding was stopped. Now that board could be coming back. Rachel Robinson has more on who could be on the board and what the point of it is. Crystal, the board will be made up of seven different members from the city and the county. And as of right now, the city and county are ready for the Midland Spaceport Development Board. They're just waiting on the state. The Midland International Air and Spaceport is the go-to airport for communities across West Texas for travel as well as the local aerospace community. Economic diversification is huge. Um, aerospace is very complementary to the oil and gas industry in terms of workforce requirement, in terms of uh, you know attitudes about industry, manufacturing, construction. So it's a great natural fit for Midland. Um, oil and gas is the core of our economy and always will be, but aerospace can find a great home here too. And now, a Midland Spaceport Development Board could be reprised after it was disbanded in 2019 due to lack of funding. There are strong indications that with this legislative session, there will be funding available for commercial spaceport infrastructure in Texas. So we wanted to strategically make the move and show that Midland is invested in aerospace and uh, we're ready to get back in the game. Right now, it's just a matter of waiting on the state legislature to decide to invest in aerospace. The governor has indicated that he would like to budget $350 million for commercial aerospace development in the state of Texas. Of course, that budget hasn't been passed yet, but it's still a good indication of uh, the direction of the legislature. This board enables us to apply for state funding, that that funding is still very much up to the legislature and up to those decision makers. So we just want to best position Midland to be able to get those funds if they become available. People that will serve on the board for the county will be Commissioner Luis Sanchez, Judge Terry Johnson, Ed Anderson, and for the city, Amy Stretcher-Burks, Lori Blong, Robin Poole, and Frank Kissinger.